so today I was messing around with the effects control of Premiere Pro 2020 and I was seeing what I could do with the uh, with the draw your own like mask thing and what I figured out is you can make your custom mask with this and this is really cool I was thinking maybe if you if there was like a scene in your film or something where there was a character looking through like a lock hole and then you could make this look like a lock for now I just chose a triangle but then you could make it to where you put the film or whatever on or in your timeline and then put this over here so where it could be like the locks point of view but this is what a little snippet of it looks like It's pretty cool just to see like the video play behind or yeah video play behind this mask and I mean you can you can make it like more blurry I think that's like really cool and you can make it like really sharp but yeah I would do like something like that if you were doing like a lock or something I just think it's and you can make like the opacity that also helps and like how big it is I just think this is a super cool tool that you can use it um, and also you can make it to where you can use the timer and make it like more apparent like here and then I think you can do it all the way over here to where it will become less blurry or whatever. I don't really know. Oh, no. You'd add the keyframe here. And then add. And, like, maybe change the opacity to, like, that. And add it there. Or something. I think I messed up the the uh, time thing but the fact of the matter is the the shaping the effects so yeah that's uh, how you can mess around with effects in Premiere Pro 2020